about day five of the harvest log and the Friday the 15th of July so we've had a, had a good week at it on winter barley um, until today where we've just made a little bit of a switch uh, while we are off the farm just with a neighbour at the winter barley yesterday and then uh, cutting the seed rate for them today. This is uh, Brighton called DK Extremus. There's about 44 hectares here, um, so just this is the last field to get this wrapped up this evening without any any problems. Um, yields are okay, um, nothing to write home about. We're averaging between three, three and a half tonnes a hectare. Uh, some of the fields that were sort of three and a half looked probably a little bit better than that, um, but it's been a, been a difficult, I guess, dry season and probably not a huge amount of grain fill. Um, and Ray does need kind of quite a lot of moisture actually towards the end when it's ripening off. So it's been really dry. Moisture's we started this morning at seven, 7.2. Uh, we're about six now. So uh, we'll need to cut some slightly wetter stuff at some stage just to try and blend that moisture away. It's got to be more than six to sell it. So comfortable at the moment. Got a few challenges with the weather forecast ahead. Uh, I think we're going to be okay-ish tomorrow and then Sunday, Monday, Tuesday getting really warm so uh, we've just got to, got to have a bit of a plan and a strategy as to what we cut and when we cut it um, so as not to do damage to the grains. Um, it'll be very brittle, very very hard, easily damaged, especially on something like malting barley and then obviously the moisture content of rape, it needs to be over six to, to sell and move so that we can get um, get the oil extracted from the crop. Uh, this will be planted with a cover crop. We actually started planting a bit of cover crop in here today. Um, and uh, we'll just carry on with that tomorrow. The next day there's actually a little bit of moisture uh, in the ground under the canopy. So it'd be quite good just to get that, uh, get those cover crops in, get them away, um, which we'll hopefully get going on tomorrow um, with, a, with a bit more earnest. So uh, yeah, this is it, day five, um, first day on rape. And uh, yeah, tune in over the weekend to see how we're getting on.